This is a volumetric video in Unreal Engine. LifeCast's volumetric video player for Unreal Engine 5 is open source on GitHub. Download the zip file from the link in the description, then extract the files. Create a new blank film and video project and name it whatever you want. Open the project's content window in Explorer, then close Unreal Engine. Copy all of the files from the zip into the Unreal Project Content folder, then restart Unreal. Now we see the default volumetric scene. Unreal's post-processing alters the colors in our scene. To restore the original colors, select the LifeCast color blueprint in Outliner, then click the Toggle LifeCast Color Settings button. Now let's change the scene to a volumetric video from library.lifecastvr.com. Create a new folder named Movies under the Content folder for the Unreal project, and copy the video file that you downloaded into this folder. Back to Unreal. Right-click in the Content Browser, then select Media, then File Media Source. Double-click New File Media Source, then select the video file that we downloaded in the Movies folder, and save. Right-click again, select Media, then Media Player. Check the box as shown. Double-click New Media Player to open its editor, then double-click New File Media Source to start the video playing in the editor, and also check Loop. Now we will repeat the same change on each of the three materials shown. Double-click the material, then in the material graph, select the texture object, and under its details, change the texture to New Media Player underscore video. Now we see a white circle because the video isn't playing yet. We'll create a button in the editor to play the video. Right click in the content browser, then select Blueprint Class, then Actor. Name it Play Video Blueprint. Edit the Blueprint Event Graph. Delete the default nodes. Create a new node for a custom event and name it Play Video, then check Call in Editor. This is what makes a button. On the left side under Variables, click plus to create a new variable and name it Media Player. Change the type to Media Player. Hold Control while dragging Media Player from the left panel into the event graph to create a new node. The details are missing an important property until we press Compile. After compiling, change the Media Player property to New Media Player. Drag a connection from the Media Player node, then search for Open Source. Change the node's Media Source to New File Media Source. Connect the trigger of the Play Video node to the Open Source node, then save the blueprint. Drag an instance of the Play Video Blueprint from the content drawer into the scene. Then under Details, find the Play Video button that we just created. Now our volumetric video is playing in Unreal Editor. It is also useful to start the video when the level begins playing. Select Open Level Blueprint. Instead of triggering on a button press, we will create a new Begin Play event node. Then follow the same steps as before to create a media player variable and an open source node.
Now when we play the level, the video starts. Thank you for watching. For more information about creating photorealistic volumetric video, visit lifecastvr.com.